Head over to BoardGamePrices.com to find the best price on Imperial Settlers, Empires of the North, and thousands of other games. Imperial Settlers Empires of the North is a civilization card game for one to four players, where each player is going to select one of these six clans, which has different combos, different ways to score, and different personalities. Now the game is all about hand management and building a tableau of cards that combo well together. Like this one has an action that allows you to spend three different resources for two points. Or this one allows you to get a point every time you spend a stone, which you can build up with different combos and upgrades. And you can also gain points for each different types of cards that you have in your tableau during the game. In addition to spending resources and playing cards from your hand that give you some benefits, you'll also be taking actions like adding more cards, gaining resources, giving yourself more flexibility, constructing buildings for free, or even sailing. Which will allow you to go to nearby or distant islands to pillage for resources, or to conquer them to have these cards be part of your tableau and actions for later on. And each of the six clans has a certain difficulty to play and different personalities to match the one for your best experience. Hello my friends, it's the Game Boy Geek here. Imperial Settlers Empires of the North has unique art on all the cards. It really draws you in. The card building combos is what this game is all about. If you like doing that, you'll love this. Uh, the action wheel is different every game. So as you take adjacent actions, it'll change from game to game. I like sailing where you're pillaging or conquering and either going to nearby island or farther island. I like that. The replayability is great because it has different clans which all feel different, but even within the same clan to sort of unlock things up. And there's also a solo mode for you. I wish the scoreboard was a little bit bigger. Sometimes you can get your engine running really well early and then you just sort of milk it the rest of the game, uh, which wasn't as good to me. And if you don't like resource management, I don't think it will make you like it. But if you like card building combo games or you're building tableaus, building combos, if you liked Imperial Settlers, I think this is better than the original. And that's what I think about this Empires of the North. Did you miss the Game Topper 2.0 Kickstarter? Have no fear, it's not too late to get in on the ultimate gaming accessory. Convert your table into a high quality gaming table with a fully portable Game Topper system and take advantage of some of the best three millimeter premium gaming mats in the industry. New styles, new sizes, and new accessories can be yours. Upgrade every game you play by late backing now at GameToppersLLC.com.